Hello everyone, welcome to another Photopea tutorial. Today I will show you how to replace sky in Photopea. Now for this you will need a pen tool. As you can see we have pen tool right here on the left side and if we just uh, hold left click we'll, we'll have three different options. We'll have free pen, pen and curvature pen. So we need actually pen tool and then we need to go here and we need to say path, right? Because this is going to be the path that we are going to do. So. Now what you will need to do is you will need to click on the image and here you will need to actually go around the mountains, at least on this image is mountains, right? And with arrow keys you can actually adjust your, uh, you know, your, your pad basically. And as you can see if we go around mountains, I will just make this quickly just for the sake of this video, but for you make sure to go detailed, right? Make sure to, to you know, go detailed and just go like this, you know? And okay, once we are done with that, we can basically, let me just go here, let me show you this. Okay, and once we're done with that, we can go around like this and we can connect the pen tool right here. Now, right click and then make a selection, right? Click OK and now this will be selected, right? Now hit the delete, uh, delete um, on your keyboard and if it's a smart object, it must be rasterized first. So right click here and rasterize and then hit delete and that will delete the sky. Now uh, just hit Control D or CMDD and that will basically delete the sky. Now what you can do is we can obviously go and you know just go here and transform controls like this, right? And then we can add a image behind this. So for example, we can go sky wallpaper. We can go to images, sky wallpaper. We can right click, save this image, right? So save this image, drag it into Photopea and obviously we can make it behind the background like this. And as you can see right now, we can go to transform controls and make this image even bigger, right? Um, as you can see right here. And that's pretty much, now you go here, transform controls. That's pretty much how to remove the sky, right? I made it a little bit quicker, but you can do this yourself as well in Photopea in a much, uh, you know, much more uh, detailed way. But that's pretty much how to do it. If you have any questions or comments, comment down below and we'll see you in the next video.